Hi there, welcome to number one Geeky Design Saz, and we are back with some more Project Zomboid because, of course, we are. Right, so how are we doing? Yes, we managed to do a little bit of uh, bits and pieces. Um, have I done my skills yet? I've done the cooking. And we managed to sort out the recovery. Fortunately, it wasn't a uh, an issue. Now, what I'm going to do is I am going to go back and grab that other car. Simply because... Uh, I'll be wanting it later for uh, mechanics and stuff. Right, let me be careful because I've got to deal with some more of these guys. Yeah, I, even though I've got this setting to um, to no respawn, they seem to be respawning anyway. Which is a bit of an annoyance, but there you go. Unfortunately, let's get some distance between me and the other one. Don't whack her in the face. I was having a, a kind of on and off chat with Drunk on Life about what uh, constitutes boring content. Because, uh, I mean, naturally he's concerned about doing build uh, episodes because it might not be the most exciting thing in the world. Because I know he does, unlike me, I, I mean, I cut out most of the thing. I usually show something once and then cut the rest of it out. But I think that the issue, that my concern with this, with the whole game now, is because everything's slowed down so much, and it takes so long to actually just get what used to be uh, something that happens, you know, within a minute, sort of thing. Is now taking a whole episode just to check out two houses. Now. For a player, that's quite exciting. It's it's something that you know you, you you enjoy because it's it's more of a challenge for yourself, and it's certainly based in the in the elements of reality. But there's always that concern that as a content maker. Whether you're boring the crap out of the people who are watching it. <laughs> and, and, the, and the question is, is, is you know, what? Well, I mean, I'm not exactly the most popular person in the world anyway when it comes to uh, YouTube content. I don't know why. Everyone keeps wondering where I've been all, my, all their lives, but... I don't know. I just put my content out. And just rely on YouTube to uh, pass my content forward. But, you know, can't complain. At least I'm enjoying what I'm doing, so. Even though I do have a whole cold at the moment, so. I do, I do apologise if. Uh, right, I think I might have just grabbed my sprinting just then. Alright, let's uh, take the fuel.
Right, I think I'm just going to take the one gas can. So I'll put another one back in the thing and then we'll just partially fill this vehicle. Probably going to get out of breath very shortly. Now I think the biggest killer I found, as I did my live stream yesterday, I wasn't feeling too great, so I thought, sod it, I'm just going to spend time playing Project Zomboid, stream talking to people, rather than just spend time moping in my bed. And uh, I think the biggest killer I've found so far is being overweight and out of breath. You just cannot do anything. So what we're going to do is we're going to head over to that house that we were at before and grab the vehicle. There you go. As expected. Now. I'm quite interested to see, after killing a load of zombies down here, how the respawn has happened, or if the respawn has happened. Welcome to the isometric walking simulator. Okay, I'm actually pleasantly. Oh, I was about to say I'm actually pleasantly surprised of how little there is here. So, one is not really. What's the car up here? Is it this car? And what I hadn't realised is it actually had some fuel in it. So let me have the gasoline. Apologise for the... Uh, blow the nose. Well, if this has got some fuel in it, I think what I'll do is I might actually take the opportunity.
Okay, looks like I proper upset the locals down there last time. Okay, let's take a look. Did I actually put the fuel in? You know, I didn't, did I? Sorry about that folks, sneezing fit, another one might be coming any second now. Oh, well, here's on me. There's one there. Okay. Well, there's two. Okay. Where's the key to the house? Folks sticking in his back, is that what it was? Ah, first day for beginners. We'll take that. Oh, sunflower seeds. Well, if you could ever plant them. Right, that in there. It is nice that you can actually now properly hear them, hear the zombies in the house now. So that, that has become a little bit easier for you. Let's see if we can get some nice. Oh no, might get some hairspray or painkillers. I probably. Why have I got a plank here? Oh, is that from when I was? No, I'm getting a bit confused. Not sure why I had a plank there. Okay, well, not much doing here. Let's pop over to the other house. Ah, let's deal with this person first. Last thing we want is uh, someone sneaking up from behind us. And they're on their own, so they're a viable target. One less zombie. I mean, I, I think the, the the one thing that I've found, even with the uh, Build 40 game, is that 
you know, never underestimate the effect of killing one zombie. Because it does start adding up after a while. Looks like I may have... Uh, Blow my nose again, so apologize. Things I suffer through for content for you guys, eh? Hope you're grateful. Right, let's deal with what's going on up here. setting set up a bit as well. Right, is there anything good in the bathroom? Bleach? Actually, I might grab that bleach because I may need to uh, clean my area out. curtains as well. <laughs> Didn't really know that uh, sheets actually weighed so much. There you go. Fortunately I now have a car. Check the kitchen, did I? Can peace. Get ourselves back to the car. And then we'll just do some uh, some home improvements, so to speak.
Okay. I might actually put this on the car park. Look at that for parking, eh? windows I've actually done today because I've done so many episodes of or versions of this I forget mostly live stream right so my upstairs is done okay add sheet close curtains Looks like I've added a sheet there, that's fine. So I need three more sheets by the looks of it. Let's move my hammer and my screwdriver. A pipe and a hunting knife. Which I must have picked up from what I'm going to do actually, thinking about it. Gas can in there. Right now, the other question is actually, there is one thing I need to do which I haven't done so far. Just check out the restaurants up here. Make hundred percent sure this is safe. The pill cure.
Now, as usual, don't know how long the electricity is going to last for. Or the water. But I do need to start looking for maybe generators and so forth. Put a saw in the fridge. So, if you're watching this and you're new to uh, Project Zomboid, be patient. I think is is the uh, is the name of the day. You've you've got to get yourself organised. If you don't get yourself organised, you're going to end up getting yourself into trouble. So a lot of the people who are probably watching this who do have experience with uh, somebody will be knowing exactly what I'm doing and why I'm doing it. And the thing is, is because Build 41 is, has, has ramped the uh, difficulty up with the zombies and made it a lot harder. Excuse me. A lot harder to deal with large groups of zombies. You're going to have to take everything a lot slower. So, this is not a game for the impatient. I mean, there was a certain amount of fun to be had in the older version where you could go through zombies and it, it, it certainly was, um, made you feel big about yourself. Right, now what am I going to do today? Uh, I think I might drive over. There's electricity for beginners there as well. Let me just check. I want to take the car that's got the vehicle that's got the um, best tyres because a long journey. Yeah, this will do. I'm going to head down to the gun store. Probably going to be a crap load of zombies there as well, so that'll be fun. It's a bit of a drive, though. So I'll probably cut this out. Running like fun. As you can see, I've got myself into uh, a deep mess. Because of course I have. I'm liking the new light system as well. It looks like... You know, the diners really lit up the, the area. I 
There you go. I mean, I have been having wonders, really, uh, whether sometimes it's me or whether the uh, system's optimised for fighting at the moment. Because there's times when you just you should be hitting them, or you just stop, you just completely just stop um, interacting at all with with the zombie, and it's just sitting there giving you free chomps on you. What? Right. You anymore? Okay. I can never tell if that's a haircut or a helmet. That's a haircut. Right, back in a sec, I need to get some more tissue. Alright, I'm quite aware. So we're getting close to time now. Has he spotted me? Okay. It's fair play. Last one first. Nice. So we'll try to get into the Try getting to the uh... gun shop. My brain always will work at some point. Oh, yeah. Ah. See if we can get in first. Make life easier if I can. Nope. Take a long work around there because the last thing you want to do is walk straight into a zombie. easier for me. Now I'm hoping soon OG ORGM will be able to be compatible once again with Build 41, but you, you, you never want... Ooh. Even though it looks like they have bought some more guns out. A scope. Okay. Have they actually started 
putting in some of the ORGM stuff in themselves anyway. Now, I do hope I bought a, uh, an axe with me, which I haven't. That's going to be a fun, fun... Okay, nothing doing in that. Electricity for intermediates. I'm starved for uh, books at the moment anyway, so... Open the door. There we go. Right. Now my big question is, can I knock this down with this lead pipe? do. I can get into the gun shop, so that's a fair dinkum. As my uh, Australian friends would say. So, turn the night out, seeing as I'm getting a bit tired. Mother. Why is nothing ever easy? Alright, line of sight block. It's these lights that uh, attract him, I'm afraid. Maybe a bit of the noise that I'm making. Where's he appeared from? I mean, come on.
That'll do. Oh, he spotted me. Big time. Oh, for God's sake. like it wasn't a bleedy scratch so that's fine where did this other one go oh there he is what see what I mean I, I, sometimes I just don't understand I hit him but I didn't Laceration. Yeah, I, I. There's, there's, there's a certain amount of pistol. Um, there's a certain amount of. Uh, issue that I take with this at the moment which is generally that sometimes you completely not you miss them even though you, you, you know you've got them banged to bang to right so to speak Come on. I mean, if I've attracted them all over here. Whether this house might be a better prospect. Oh. Is that a cycle helmet you've got in there? Yep, I'll wear that. Never get a hundred percent help. And make sure that I make no well, hardly any noise. It's in the frit mustard. Huh? It's, have I got a can opener? Please tell me I've got a can opener. Oh, I do. as well. Alright. 
finally make sure that this place is uh, all hunky dory and then I am going to say whilst I'm here if you like what you like press the like button if you dislike what you dislike press the dislike button but please pop something down in the comment section to let me know how I can improve my content for you because basically this is what it's all about entertaining you guys um, if you really like it don't forget to press the subscribe button uh, if you super like it uh, why not press the bell icon as well while you're at it to um, get notified whenever I did I just remove curtains I'm a muppet Whenever I do new content, closed curtains is what I wanted. Okay, so all that's left for me to say is thanks very much for watching, guys. See you soon. Bye bye.